Eh. <coughs> a little on the late side, but we're gonna play some Martinio. Dolby Pro Logic the second. A long line of prestigious people. Okay, so I don't remember what the volume balance was for this. So I'm gonna have to figure it out. Did not write it down. That's how long ago this was. It was in my old file. Anyway, Duichi. Check, check, let's see. Check. Maybe about here. Let's see. There's a comet there. I don't know, I need to get into a proper level. Before I can make judgment. Let's see. Check. Check. I- that was probably good enough. I could've used that. Check. Check. Test. Burrito. Chicken nugget. Taco. Muffin. Maybe one decibel. Like right here. Check. Check. Well, maybe that's too much. I don't know. Let's see, right here. Right here. Check. Check. Yeah, that might be the sweet spot. Right there. Luigi's getting bored! Check. Check. Test. 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 Okay, I'm gonna- I'm gonna say that's good. Anyway, we gotta- We gotta race. We gotta race Dark Luigi. Luigi's inner demons. And believe me, there's a lot of them. And I think he's better at racing than Mario is. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No. No. I might honestly lose to this guy. I am so out of practice. It has been like actually 40 years since I played this game. No, 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 oh! And just like Tails, Luigi gets so embarrassed that he dies. Sometimes I hate the way this game controls. Like, I don't know, there's something just weirdly sticky about it sometimes. I mean, maybe I'm just saying that because I'm out of practice again, but like... I don't know, just something about the, the- it's just something's a little sticky about it. Either way, I got it.
Why, yes, I think I will. Probably save some time by not doing that. Oh, that's right. Okay, we gotta wait eight hours because I'm on the Wii right now. And we gotta we gotta warm up the emu nand. Don't worry, it'll, it'll just it'll just take a minute. <laughs> you just gotta warm it up. There we go. Yeah. That's the only time it should do that. If you don't remember Metroid Prime 2, then that's what's going on here. Okay, fine. All right, this feller. Yeah, we'll do this real quick. A very sticky picky, indeed. All right, this. This nonsense. Give me those, thank you. Wait a minute, wait a minute. L listen to that sound effect, listen to that. That's the same, like, stock sound effect as jumping in Scooby-Doo Night of 100 Frights. I can't believe that they thought, <laughs> they thought I wouldn't notice. <laughs> oh, I know too much, I must be killed. Love how my lives reset. Love it. Love it. There we go. That's better. Well, now we can just do this. Get a few more lives. Just so I don't feel so self conscious. I mean, there's a life down there, but it's like... Hey, you know what, whatever. We'll get it. Just because I'm so based, and it's just effortless for me. I say getting hit with a bomb. But that's part of the funny, really. No, no, Luigi, Luigi, land, land on the... <laughs> Am I so out of practice? No, it's the game that's wrong. <laughs> Nah, not even going for that. Yahoo! 
very treacherous. There we go, okay. <laughs> like, it's just amazing how effortless it is for me. Oh, we're back out here. Oh yeah, that's right, because I never went in one of the domes. You know, I was having a conversation recently. I don't remember where it was. It might have been in Club Saturn, it might have been in the Geek Critique server, I don't remember. This is kind of a weird hub world when you think about it. Like, it, it sort of tries to have its cake and eat it too. It's like... Oh yeah, that's right, I forgot about this. But it's like, it has an exploratory element to it. But at the same time, it like funnels you into these domes where you get like a world map. It's kind of, it's kind of peculiar and truth be told, I don't think it works quite as well as the two that came before it. Of course, compared to Odyssey, which, you know, like, <laughs> well, Odyssey is just a world map and I mean, Galaxy 2 is kind of an offshoot of this. Where it's like... But it, instead of like a bunch of little world maps, it's one big one. Top Maniac and the Top Man Tribe. This isn't Mario, that's Luigi. Yes! I, I beat the game with Mario like a million years ago. And then I was like, okay, you know, I'll... I'll do the game again as Luigi, but, you know, I'll kind of just take it out gradually. Emphasis on g gradually. Because it's probably been months since I've touched it. But, as, as we've been talking about... I'm hoping to <laughs> kind of rectify that a little bit, like... I have too many quote-unquote side games, and I'm hoping to deal with that. So basically it's just gonna be Yoshi's Island side game, Yoshi's Island side game, until Yoshi's Island's taken care of, of course, and then something will take its place. But basically one, one major game slot is how I'm planning on dealing with things for a little while. Those guys kind of look like Kirby characters a little bit. I mean, Mario and Kirby characters kind of have a lot of overlap, I'd say. There's a few you could transplant from one to the other and nobody would really know. I mean, be real. If I if I showed you a Waddle D, and I asked, and you'd never seen these games before, and I asked you to tell me which one it it was from, would you be able to do it? Like honestly. Oop. <laughs> well, yes, that's a fair point. I guess color code the ones that will kill you. I mean, they're not just color coded, they're also like pepperminty. Which is fitting because it's Christmas time, but yes, they thought of the colorblind. We're not playing on the Super NES anymore, we are well into the era where Nintendo was like, Oh wait, people with disabilities actually exist. We didn't know that. Dang, we're sorry. <laughs> Hello, Pigeon Lord 21. And yes, 
This is Luigi Galaxy. Markedly less red than normal. Okay, I wasn't sure if they would accept the green one. Now, I know there are a few shortcuts in this game that Luigi can do that Mario cannot do, but I don't know what they are, so don't ask me. But he does, he does actually jump higher. I mean, that sounds like a given, but you, you never really know. Did you know that Luigi's Mansion may or may not have originally intended Mario to be playable? As there is a Mario model in the game that is mapped to Luigi's skeleton, which is a lot, a lot less gross and painful than it sounds like. You know, maybe, maybe there was going to be a multiplayer mode. Which, I mean, we would later get. In fact, I may have streamed the multiplayer mode. Oh, that's the first time hearing of that. Well, go to uh, tcrf.net, look up Luigi's Mansion, and it, it should be there. If you don't believe me, which I'm not, you know... I'm, but it's, it's, always, it's always good to do a little research, a little independent research, just to be safe, because I've been wrong before. But I'm pretty confident on that one. But yeah, Luigi in this game is, like, mapped to Mario's skeleton, so it's, it's, it's like it's hard to tell during gameplay, but this is actually a little bit shorter than Luigi normally is. I, I actually might have pointed that out last stream, last time I streamed this. Because... You can actually stand next to Luigi as Luigi. I forget if I've done that already, but oh, whatever, we all know about it. Last stream I might have cared about spoiling that, but not this one. Last stream, Dustin was a more naive man. He didn't know the cruel, the cruel nature of the universe quite as I do. You know what, let's see actually, do I have him yet? Do I have Parallel Luigi? Uh, no, it doesn't look like I do. So, uh, spoilers, I guess. <laughs> I say as if that's like an actual plot thing, I don't know. I don't know, like I said, wait, everyone here knows about it, let's not kid ourselves. Let's not pretend. So still, I, I still gotta do the trash mission here. And believe me, it is a trash mission. There's supposed to be a vacuum overheating and a poison status, yet yeah, it's kind of crazy. There's a lot of a lot of stuff going on in that game. And, uh, there might have been a bad ending where you didn't actually save Mario. Until Nintendo was like, oh, that's kind of messed up, actually. I can only assume. I, I think there was, like, a omnipresent time limit originally, like, sort of a Pikmin-type thing. That one I could be wrong about, though, but I feel like I remember... 
I, I remember there being something about, like, there was going to be a 24-hour time limit. I mean, probably not 24 real hours, because Luigi's Mansion is much shorter than that. I mean, who knows? Maybe that's why they got rid of it. Maybe they were like... Maybe they were like, oh my god, this is way too much time. <laughs> probably not. I, oh, yeah, and Pikmin did have an advertisement in Luigi's Mansion, I forgot. So it all comes together, really. Okay, so here we go. Time to do this again. Welcome to the worst planet in the galaxy. Oh, oh, wait. I just remembered. The, the, the genesis of this filter, I have, I have to do it justice, you know? This is the ammo depot, not a garbage dump. What, do people think they can just toss their trash in here and it'll magically disappear? Hey, we have plenty of bombs. Maybe you could use them to blow up all this trash? Gee, thanks. Okay, let's see what I can do about this. Now's your chance to be a bomb shot. Oh yeah, I remember. I remember the problems that arise. There's an unused Luigi model called Luigi. I don't know why I find that so amusing. Eh. Because misspelling things on purpose is funny. <laughs> Believe me, I know. Okay, I might have it. There we go. Who knew that bombs work so well as an industrial strength cleaner? Thanks, I owe you big. Oh, I know. Take this. I just found it laying around. Maybe it will help. It's kind of like, if Waluigi is evil Luigi, then Luigi is bizarro Luigi. He's Luigi, but he says the opposite of what he means, and he just kind of smells funny and nobody likes to be around him. The super demented Crash Bandicoot, but Luigi. Yeah, fake Crash. <laughs> they just like they just give Crash uh, <laughs> a unibrow and no dental plan. I could probably make some joke about him being British, but I have at least one British viewer, so I will refrain. Except I actually just said it, so. Just gonna, just gonna vibrate on the edge a little bit. Oh. 
Oh, there's nothing up here for me. Okay, I need you to move. Thank you. We Honestly, it's funny to think, but the gravity is honestly kind of rudimentary in its programming. Like, it just has gravity fields, like the same way you'd have camera flags or whatever. But I mean, it works, you know, it gets the job done. It might be here. It might be here where there's a shortcut Luigi can do. Oh no, no, that's not gonna work. Okay, never mind. I'm, let's let's pretend we did, and instead don't. This is the part where Nintendo 64 nostalgia was happening. I love the freaking noises that they that they had Bowser start making. You think Jack Black will do that? Uh, who am I kidding? He does that even when he's not Bowser. <laughs> you finally made it. Just in time for me to stomp you into space dust. Ah, crud. Ah, poopy cruddy. Stinky. <laughs> Come on, shake. Wario Land, shake it. You know, I should become a video game end boss so I can create rings when I stomp somewhere. That's like the one thing I can't do. Oh, no. There we go. I think I said it last time, but I love, I love the choir that, <laughs> that joins in once Bowser's spinning on his back. <laughs> It's just something about the timing of it. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Oh, but now he goes fast. Luigi, my plan is too far along now. You really think you can stop me? <laughs> okay, so there's the finished business from last time. Why, yes, it is. <laughs> oh. I'm, I'm, I'm all right, I'm just dying.
Okay, now we can go to the kitchen. Yes. Actually, it's my brother's girlfriend, not mine. I don't, I don't know why I'm here. Yep, yep, enemy base. But we're not doing that right now. Because I just got here. Well, to the beach we go. But this time we're not going to stop anywhere to hear about uh, chunks or anything like that. We're going to do this speedy. We're going to be real efficient about the whole thing. Whatever, they're gone now. I need to find the fifth one. That's always the one I have trouble with. Not it right there. No. Turn the camera, please. Okay, thank you. I mean, I think they're all <clears throat> all underwater. But I'm gonna check up here anyway. Yeah, I don't, I don't see. Hmm. Is it underneath? It is not underneath. Oh no, it isn't, isn't... Oh no, it's right there. What do you mean I can't wall jump off of this? I have been cheated. They just know I do the jump. They're jealous. Ow. No sea urchin from Super Mario World, please leave me be. No, you know what? I'm not even going to hit the switch. Because I don't need it. Luigi does not need your pitiful switch. He is and always was a Wii U man. That's where he had his year.
an, ev an event which I have been told <laughs> cost Nintendo unholy amounts of money, which, frankly, just fits the character, I feel like. Like, yes, of course the year of Luigi would be a resounding failure. Why would it not be? <laughs> Okay, now, what does this mission want from me? Does it want me to, like... It wants me to get the shell, right? That's this mission. Oh, yeah, the gold shell. The gold shell. Oh, that was a camera. Oh, have you ever heard of camera? He's here. Meet him live and in person. Lakitu is coked up and it's got nowhere to go. Okay, that's the mission. See, there's a glitch where if you throw the golden shell at the same frame that you touch the star, Luigi will come out of the TV and kill you. Of course, I've never been able to pull it off. Bud Flag Cave. Oh. You give me motion sickness, why don't you? How do I get the shell? I know there's a shell. I mean, this is a worthwhile enough endeavor. Nope, bye-bye. But, it has not brought me any closer to Shell. I'm still in Shell Hell, because I do not remember where you get it. Oh, oh, it's just right there, okay. You know, it's almost like not playing a game for several months, you'll forget something about it.
I right, just gotta break Tingle out of prison real quick. Okay, here we go, here we go. Why did Luigi, like, fall on his butt? Oh no, oh no. No, I, no, I will live forever. Okay, Luigi can't make that jump, not quite. You gotta wait for the assistment before you can do this sort of thing. You know, this was Miyamoto's favorite enemy. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, I'm fine. I mean, I'm, I'm of course being a silly man here, but I, I do think he said that the, the Mario 64 Tox Box was his favorite enemy in that game because of how... how well it conveyed its purpose. And the Tox Box is my least favorite enemy in that game. Well, no, that's probably not true. <laughs> but I don't much care for them. I, I tend to avoid interacting with them whenever possible. But hey, in, in Mario 64 DS, Wario can punch them. Which I did not know, and a lot of people apparently did not either. But Supper Mario Broth is the giver of forbidden knowledge. Oh no, no, I've done it again! Uh, go to- go to Supper Mario Broth on, like, Twitter or Tumblr or something. Uh, you might have to scroll a little bit, but you should- you should find it in there somewhere, I think. Oh no, wait, maybe it wasn't Mario Broth, I just- I kind of assume it is, though. Those rolling block things, they can be Wario punched. Yes. I didn't know either. I, I think nobody knew because nobody plays as Wario in that game. God, poor, poor dude, poor Wario. They really gave him the stinky sock on that one. No! <laughs> I should probably just do this the normal way because my sh my shortcut is eating up more time than it would have saved. You see that now I am golden. I mean, not literally. That that wouldn't happen until New Super Mario 2. Behold, the only new gameplay mechanic we bothered to come up with for this New Super Mario game. We also didn't come up with any new music either. We just... I won't lie to you, we really phoned it in.
to Pizza Hut. We ordered a pizza, and then when it got here, there was a 3DS cartridge on top of it. And I told them explicitly that I ordered pepperoni, but they wouldn't take it back, so we just published it as a new Mario game. <laughs> My commentary is especially stupid tonight, I'm sorry. I got up at I got up at 11 a.m. today, and this is what it does to a man. Imagine what people getting up at 7 a.m. are like. What do you mean? Like, why do you think I am the best streamer in the universe? It's because I actually get ludicrous hours of sleep that a streamer needs. But then, you sleep too late and you can't stream anymore. Such is the dil such is the dilemma of the streamer. What was this? What was, what was this? I love that the Koopa shell has like headlights. Even though, uh... These wouldn't be headlights. Well, I mean, it does have headlights. See, like, right here. But I mean, whatever. These are, like, brake lights. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, Luigi, that was really impressive, but please don't do it again. Luigi, I did not consent to you jumping out of the water. Please. please. Well, okay, that time I pressed the A button, but I was meaning to go this way. Okay. There we go. I, d I couldn't remember what was in there, but I remembered something was in there. I'm driving and I'm speeding. I'm sorry. You know, there, there are certain songs that the internet has cursed forever, and this is one of them. And then I'm done. I mean, the internet will curse everything if given enough time. No, no, don't need it, don't need it. I'm gonna make a, a curse. No, I'm gonna make a curse version of this song. But I, I need to think of something for it to be cursed about. Okay, I got, I got something. I got something. Here we go. Pants are going down. Slap my booty. Slap my booty. Slap my booty. No, I'm sorry. This is not. This is not a worthwhile use of our time. But it's already too late. It's already too late, now we're all gonna hear it. No matter how stupid it is. No, come on, come on. Come, come on. Come on, come on. Go on. There we go.
a new chapter has been added to the storybook. I don't care, Luigi doesn't read. Luigi and the Haunted Mansion. Oh! It's just like- see, it's just like I told you, it's me, I'm in there. It's a really deep metaphor for, you know, the rescue of the self. Come on, give me that. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Okay, now I am in the mansion. Now just come over here. Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. Vibrate a little bit on the staircase. Oh, somebody put a statue of Bowser in my fireplace again. This is the eighth time this week that's happened. This guy's got the key, come on. Come on. Yeah, that's what I thought. And it's one of the magic keys that just automatically unlocks whatever it needs to. You don't even put it in the door. It's kind of a security risk, honestly. <laughs> would not advise, would not advise having that. I also would not adv advise sticking black holes in your window. I mean, but that's just me. Like, you can do whatever you want, ultimately. But I, I just- I can't help but feel like it's a little unsafe. Man, they took my coins away. Just like the government. <laughs> Get back here. Get back here. You know, I've been... We've been having a gnat problem around one of our windows, so maybe- maybe a black hole would be the solution to that. Though, so I- I take it back. Oh, oh, I remember... I remember something really funny. So there's like, uh, flags that you can place. Well, you can place- that they placed around the levels. Where basically it's like, okay, uh, place a flag here and Mario will not be able to fall asleep. You know, just like, stuff like during boss battles and whatnot. But I think they said that... <laughs> right here is an area where they did not do that, so <laughs> Mario can just fall asleep. <laughs> in front of Luigi begging for help. Of course, I, I don't really have the time to test that theory. We got places to be. No, ow! I did not consent to the dead. Oh, 
Oh, now I gotta become Booigi. Do Dooichi. I mean, I appreciate they made Luigi playable because they had to make like a Boo Luigi model. You know, that's not free. You can't buy that at Walmart. Are you me? Well, I guess there's enough people in the universe for one person to look like me. Anyway, I found a power star. Let's take it back. Yeah. Luigi's just like, yeah, stati statistically, Thanks. it makes sense I have a doppelganger. Statistically. It's the whole monkey on a typewriter type thing. Infinite people in an infinite universe means that someone will eventually be Luigi. And that's kind of inspiring if you ask me. Look. Yeah, so it's just they didn't switch it to Mario or anything. <laughs> they just have two Luigis. Who cares? <laughs> If Luigi is so good, then how come... Yeah. So, you can kind of see right here. Sort of. But, let me... Can I stand right next to him? Like, uh... Playable Luigi is just slightly shorter. Now, they kind of have him hunched over a little bit, but I'm pretty sure he is... Like, his legs are shorter. Something like that. I forgot what exactly it was, but it's like it's Mario's skeleton. I mean, it's hard to- it's not easy to notice unless you're looking out for it, though. Well, since we're out here... Let us engage in feederism and be rewarded. There's so many galaxies with drip in the name. Which I did not notice until that word became funny. Well, actually, maybe it's just one or two, but... But it's weird that it happened twice. Okay. Chasing an eel. Actually, this isn't working. We need- we need a different approach. This isn't what I was talking about, but it'll work. Breathing in an air bubble has got to be hard. That doesn't sound- that doesn't seem like it would be easy. These video game characters, they just make it look so effortless, but that's why they're the professionals. Ah, oh, crap. He was not within the zone. The homing area. The home field. Now where's the shell? I need a shell for this whole operation to work. Hey, 
And there's a red one right there. Go figure. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yep, rule of three. There we go. Oh, shit. Now, where is it? Where's it? It's there. Okay, so let me, uh, wait, what is this? Oh, that's booey base. But let me, let me go here first to the, the bubble trouble galaxy. Through the poison swamp, AKA browsing Twitter. You just gotta, you just gotta get some good filters. You gotta point at what you don't want to see and say, I don't want to see this. <laughs> and that's how you make... No! Please, please! I already played the game! I have already played the game, please, Mr. Board. You're boarding me. I think I might have said this before, but like, this implies that the cursor, the Wii cursor, is a physical object in in universe. Oh, hey, Kovar and Kovarians, Kovardvarks, whatever y'all are calling yourselves, I forgot. No, no, no. No, 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 no. But yes, the Wii, the Wii remote cursor is a physical object in universe and I don't know what this implies. No, I know that's possible. Oh, wait, maybe you gotta do like. Yeah, like that. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, I'm still alive. I am still alive. Okay. So you just don't have to do the second part. Second part is optional content. <laughs> My favorite part of the game is when I don't have to play it. And what the heck, go to boy base, get the good music. Get the good Mario Galaxy Orchestra music. I think that skip is only possible with Ouija. I know there are some that are, but I, I feel like I did that as Mario, but I might be full of hot air. Completely full of it. Yeah, 
Yeah, I know how to swim. I've been playing the game. I'm beginning to think these penguins don't trust me. All right, the the bullet. Okay, come over here. That quote is something Kovar actually said. I don't believe you. Kovar has never talked, ever. Kovar has taken a vow of silence. Okay, cool. Y'all wanna like, c come here, come here. Hi. God dang it. They put these orbs here specifically to annoy me. Come on. Come. Can you, like, drown and die, please? Thank you. Okay, no. I want to meet the guy. I want to meet the guy at Nintendo that came up with, that came up with the bullet bill system in this game. I just want to talk. I just, I just, I just want to have a word. I mean, it's sort of fun, but it's also very annoying. It's kind of a paradox in that way. It's kind of like uh, one third of Mario Sunshine. Yes. The green stars have the power of green. You're green with it. That is not even remotely what Mike Wazowski, White Mike Wazowski sounds like. Sunshine is only fun, not annoying. All right, he said it, not me. We still gotta go to the Pokeball, so we're not done here yet. The floating fortress of the Egg Carrier. I'm pretty sure the power of green is also a thing in Powder Ranger. The only Power Ranger that is not allowed to have power is white, because that's offensive. I'm in a group with a lot of people who like Power Rangers. And I watched a little bit of it as a baby, and then never again. I was much more into playing as Jumping Green Italian Man. Much more mature. Yes, let me feel you. Let me feel you, Stoneman. Hey guys, what if Dwayne The Rock Johnson was actually just that? Like, what if he was just literally a big rectangle rock man? You think that'd be funny? 
You think he'd still have a movie career? Would he have wrestled? I mean, and actually, if you're a big, if you're a big cube, you're probably good at wrestling. Well, I mean, I guess it depends. Can you move yourself? Because, like, see, Thwomps here, they can move of their own volition. Which is not possible, not usually possible of creatures without limbs. But by God, they make it work somehow. If you're ever, like, you know, doubting yourself, you're ever like, oh, I can't do this. I can't get that job. Remember that Thwomp moves of his own volition. And realize that you are better than you know. What powers would he get from being a stone golem? I mean, I don't know, being made of stone, like, you're, you're really hard. But, but not like that. Don't, don't read too much into it. That being said, you... I don't know, I mean, no, no. Can golems heal themselves? Like, if, like, if I chip a piece off of him, if I get, like, a hammer and chisel, and, like, chip a piece off of the rock. Does he grow it back, or is that, like, a, a flesh thing? He might not be able to get that back. He might just be missing that part forever. I wouldn't do that to him. The, the rock never hurt me. A very spooky sprint. Uh, it's a little out of season, but you know, whatever. Yeah. It's weird to think, you know, like this, this right here. This is inside you right now. And like Nintendo, Nintendo won't show blood. And they'll only barely talk about dead people, but... You want a femur? You want to see a femur? We'll show you a femur. You could probably just replace it with a random pebble. I mean, yeah, I guess that's true. Maybe he could just, like, super glue something in there. Oh yeah, this is the secret. The negative space zone. But then, then we sort of get into a ship of Theseus dilemma, where it's like, at what point does it cease to be Dwayne Johnson? At what point have I just built a replica? What is the nature of the self? I mean, that's the- that's really the takeaway from this game. Like, you know, forget the rebirth of the universe or whatever. It's like, what is the nature of the self? That is like, okay, rebirth of the universe, that's Mario's whole thing. Like, that's Mario's storyline. Luigi's storyline is... When does one cease to be himself? Can you be Luigi if there is another Luigi just like you? 
Are you replaceable? <laughs> that was very sudden. If I replaced you with an exact clone with all your memories and experiences and nobody knows, nobody knows that that's a clone and I kill you and replace you with the clone and I don't, I don't tell anybody. I don't even tell the clone. Does life carry on? Would your family ever be able to know the difference? Truly, this is the future AI is going to bring us. And more importantly, if Jimmy cracks corn and no one cares, why does he keep doing it? Yeah. Let's race. <laughs> Let's go away. Let's go away. <laughs> Love the big old just like m meat things. The lamb, the, what, what would you even call it? Just the cartoon rotisserie meat. The, the meat that cavemen are all the time cooking. Okay, no, that doesn't work. I thought maybe I could, like, you know, just <laughs> kind of gravitate towards the planet. No. I wonder what my actual best time on that is. I mean, hey, if anybody wants a challenge, you can go back. To when I did that as Mario, find the YouTube video, go back, uh, compare the times. Because I sure ain't gonna bother. <laughs> okay, one more star here. No way! I can't believe this! You know, honestly, I, I, maybe I should make those sound alerts a, a little bit cheaper. I might have overcompensated. Maybe, maybe about 750 might be a good price. Yeah, I... I'm, I'm definitely charging way too much for that, and if you want to know why, look up Robotnik Inflation. Oh. 
and then the stairs are gone. My pa my parents took them because I am grounded. That's like the one part from Ed and Eddie that I will never forget ever. Because I mean, how, how, how could you? Give me that back. Nope. I am not interacting with the spider. I am not acknowledging his existence. And there's nothing you can do to make me. straight up the same spring sound effect from the Scooby-Doo game. Like, literally the exact same one. I wonder if I should, like, report that to anybody. Like, there's probably some kind of video game sound preservationist that cares about that. Fight. Gotta fight this guy. I was gonna try to come up with an insult, but I couldn't think of anything funny. Uh, stone head. You see what I t see? I told you it wasn't funny. Dwayne The Rock Johnson. He's here. badly right now. Every Nintendo game gotta have a hand boss.
Oh, there's a comet. It's the comet, too. You know, we might as well try to get it out of the way. Just say that we did it. It's over with. Mm, pardon me. Okay, now to do the same exact thing I just did, but without taking damage. Life, one. And that's right, baby, because you got one life to live. Unless I clone you. Then I guess you technically have two. Oh, crap, crap. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Oh. Okay, phase one. We're good. Please get wrecked at your earliest convenience, thank you. Ah oh, crap, I ran out of juice. Well, I have now permanently crippled this rock golem. Just as I said I would do. It, it's truly all coming together in a way that I did not predict. Except he did get it back, so I guess that answers that question. So, the answer to the question is... Dwayne Johnson can get it back. But if I hit his uvula, then he dies forever. Unless I do a daredevil mission. But believe you me, I don't think I could take on Dwayne Johnson with one HP. <laughs> I don't think... I don't think that would end well for me. And we're still not done, if you can believe it. You think he'd hit you? Yes. Yes, I do. I think that is a battle where I would take at least one damage. But very likely more. I skipped all the money. I knew my speed run tactics would bite me in the butt one day. Yeah. 
It's also possible to die dabbing in real life. So don't try me, boy. something messed up about becoming a mushroom that I then consume. I mean, I guess that's what m meat is, sort of. But, you know, the chicken usually doesn't talk to me before he does it. Like, I'm not a vegetarian, but if that happened, then I might be. <laughs> I, I, even I have my limits. <laughs> and then Pete is just like, we have to, we have to genetically engineer the talking chicken. Speed, speed up research. Ow. I am doing everything in my power to ignore every part of this fight, and it's not working out for me. Arrgh. My aim is so dreadful. That trajectory should be fine. Don't lie to me. Oh yeah, you gotta jump because there's an electro fence. For one reason only. And that is to make me miss my shot. Okay, it only takes two hits that time. But, I mean, I guess that's a total of five. That's not a bad number. That's a pretty reasonable number. What time is it? What time are we looking at? We're okay. We're okay. I'll go, go a little bit longer. Every loop you miss with sails off into the infinite universe forever. What? Eventually they stop thinking. Well, I know that's a JoJo reference. So that's the part my brain, like, gravitated to. 720! The Xbox? Why, why did they not call it the Xbox 720? Like, really? <laughs> Or the Xbox, like... What? X- Xbox One. Why- why do you call it the Xbox One? That makes no sense, and it, it is a Google nightmare. I'm still mad about that. I mean, not that Series X is much better. Uh, it's a little better. But not by much. Xbox One. They, they really went and they called it the Xbox One. A, a team of... <laughs> a team of executives looked at that and said, Yup, that's the one we want to go with. I'm convinced, like, like, I could just, what, I, if I really applied myself, 
I could, I could get a really high paying job at, <laughs> at a company like that. I'd just be like, uh, yeah. So the next Xbox is gonna be called the Xbox, uh, Poo Poo Stinky Up My Butthole. And they'll just be like, yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> that's pretty good. Why didn't we think of that? I mean, say what you will about it being unimaginative or whatever, but... PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, it makes sense, you know what it is, it's easy to Google. <laughs> Leave me alone, I'm going to bed. It's so weird, like looking in on an looking in on an inverted sphere. It is really trippy, honestly. You never you never really get over that. I missed the coin. Money bags. Money bags. Yes. So another fun story about this game. Well, actually, I don't think I've told any fun stories about this game. It was mostly about Luigi's Mansion. But either way, the music was originally going to be a lot more... I don't know how to put it. Just like chipper. And maybe more childish. As, as they put it, at least. And then they were just like, no, no, we, we, we want you to play Mario and cry. And then they did. My, those star bits are, well, they're over here, actually. I was going to say they were gone forever. That is not the case. Why did I get so much air? The world may never know. We're going back to the cube. Yeah, try and catch me, bitch. But Luigi is much faster than Mario. He is much more agile. You, you did not expect... You did not expect, but nobody expects. Luigi is the second banana, but that is the ace up his sleeve as well. Nobody expects him. They're all prepared for Mario. And then you got old Wasabi shirt coming in here. They don't know what to think.
you know, just think- just thinking about that set of Mario flashcards that depict Luigi reading about and reacting in horror to the Nazis. That's pretty cool. I'm glad Nintendo made that. I'm dead. Yeah. There's not even a black hole. Luigi just falls. Falls to the cloudy depths below. It's like, can you even call this a galaxy? Honestly? I mean, you probably can't call any of these galaxies, but I mean, we're in an, we're in an atmosphere. There is clearly a skyline. What sort of nonsense be this? I demand realism in my mole getting slapped by green plumber game. How dare... How dare they... He talks about Zero that way. Is that... Is that another Frostbolt thing? Because I, I, I don't know any of these characters, I'm sorry. No, we, we don't know. <laughs> we don't know who these people are. Okay, time to cause great pain to the worm. I take no pleasure in this. I must simply use it for transport. Uh, yeah, I can't wait to lose my 50 lives. All those lives I've earned. All those people I've stepped on. Wasted. Oh, I did not run into that. I thought I was going to. And you did too. Greater galaxy of coolified heroes shared thing. Well, baby, honey, baby, I love you, but none of us, none of us know any of that. None of us. No, no! Now he's mad. He's furious. There we go.
I couldn't resist the JoJo reference. Well, that much I understand. Finally, you speak to me in words that I understand. That I feel in my soul. So we'll do this star, and that'll probably be it. That seems like a good stop in place. Gusty Gardens Gravity Gramble. You know, just in case you hadn't picked up on this dude yet. You know, whatever, I don't care. I can't- I cannot be bothered. Oh, I am <laughs> I done missed it. I have brought shame to my family forevermore. Ooh, uh, yes, deposit, deposit me, please. Thank you. Oh, there's the gold one. I forgot what his deal was. Is there a star in him? There might be a star in him. I must break him open to get at the creamy center. Hmm. Oh wait, maybe, maybe if you destroy like one of these things. It'll give you, like... Oh. I am surprised that it gave that to me. I am not gonna lie to you. You never know how these things are gonna go! Ow. Oh no. Oh no, that's that's not good. Let me, let me get out of here actually. Let me let me leave this place. There is nothing for me here. Oh, I thought this was a 2D section. Ah oh, yes, good. Give me the give me the coins cuz I'm tired of the beeping noise. I mean, is that a beep? <laughs> Luigi getting electrocuted again. It's more, it's more like a buzzing noise, I guess. Not a beep. Very important, very important distinction that must be made. This is what separates us from our forefathers. If I made this game, I would have been mean and made the rolling thing crush you if you got hit by them. I bet you didn't. But they didn't, did they, Mr. Squidward? No, no. Wait, does this- would that- That won't drop me off. What- what? What is- What is dropping? What is off? All things are relative. Oh! Oh! 
Like, I'm just gonna say it. I don't think the gravity in this game makes much sense. I'll be, I'll, I'll be totally honest. I know. I, I was trying to protect Miyamoto's feelings, but it just doesn't make a lot of sense. Ah, uh, 45. That's a that's a good number. We still got a little bit to go before we're truly done with Mario Galaxy or Luigi Galaxy. I want to get on top of the bed. I want to I want on top. There you go. Can Luigi go to sleep up here. Well, you know what? I'm gonna keep the raid train a going. And I'm gonna raid my friend Zero. Oh, wait, he's falling asleep. He's falling asleep. Oh, oh crap, I dropped the Wii remote. Luigi was startled. But yeah, I'm gonna raid my friend Zero Kirby. Access missing. You start. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. How do I. Wait, how do I do that? What? Okay, I guess I'll have to go to the Twitch website to do that. Let me see here. Chatty does not have the necessary permissions, even though I swear I thought it did. Okay, so that'll be the end of my stream. I'll see you.